അമൃത്വേണി ഹെയർ ഇലിക്സർ ഫോർ വിമൻ ബയോടെക്നോളജി പ്രകാരം എഞ്ചിനീയറിംഗ് ചെയ്ത ഹെയർ ഇലിക്സർ അമൃത്വേണി എന്നാൽ മുടിക്കുള്ള അമൃത് ബിൽഡ് യുവർ ബ്രാൻഡ് ഗ്ലോബലി മേക്ക് യുവർ വെഞ്ചർ സക്സസ് യുണൈക് ടൈംസ് പ്രീമിയം ബിസിനസ് ലൈഫ് സ്റ്റൈൽ മാഗസീൻ Hello beautiful people, I'm Shalu Raj, I'm from Coimbatore, the cotton city, the southern Manchester of South India. I'm a psychologist, a coffee blogger, an entrepreneur. With my courage and confidence, I started my venture, Vivaha the Luxury Wedding Private Limited, which is quite popular in Coimbatore. I'm a fitness freak and a trained classical dancer. I aim at keeping myself fit physically, spiritually and mentally. I love As the famous Tamil poet says, Thondrin pugalodu thondruga, Agdilar thondrulin thondrami nandru, which means, if you are born in this world, be like a king or queen, adorn your crown, walk with glory, help others, if otherwise you are not supposed to be born. I believe in that quote. Don't allow anyone to dim your light. My dear queens, keep your head held high and walk with glory. Thank you. Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you so much. Shalu. Inviting the next contestant, Saumya Salidhar from Kerala. A very shy and introvert 10-year-old girl rocked every stage she got with her energetic and flamboyant dance. As she was born in a conservative family, she couldn't learn dance. But now, she emerged from all the obstacles she faced as a strong, independent and bald woman with more confidence. Namaskaram Kochin, I am Saumya Salidhar from Patramdita District, Kerala. I am a software engineer by profession, a model, actor and a dancer by passion. Before a year ago, I got a chance to learn acting. That helped me a lot to stay positive and realize my true self. I was a very emotional person who cried a lot and was very close to everyone. But I used it in every acting situations and learned when to be emotional and when not to be. I described myself as a resilient person who bounced back from every adversities and setbacks with more strength. I consider failure as a stepping stone to success and I believe that my perseverance will help me to be successful one day and it is not too far. I am happy to represent Kerala in Mrs. South India 2023 competition and I am sure that others can be proud of me. Thank you so much. Thanks a lot, dear. Now for the self-introduction, I would like to invite Dr. Shravanti Perika from Telangana. Good afternoon and happy Pongal to everyone. I am Dr. Shravanti Perakam, cardiothoracic physiotherapist. I am working as Vice Principal and Professor in Durgabai Deshmukh College of Physiotherapy and I am a Senior Consultant at various clinics in Hyderabad. I am the first woman physiotherapist to be awarded a PhD in entire Telangana. I was recently awarded as a Mother Teresa Seva Ratna Award for providing healthcare services to the society. In spite of, apart from the teaching, and treating the patients, I am interested in fashion and fitness. I was crowned as Mrs. Glory Hyderabad 2018. All I could able to do this because of my family members, my extended family, my lovely husband, my nine years old Akarsh. I thank, I thank Mrs. South India Pegasus for giving me this opportunity. Thank you everyone. Thank you for the introduction. Next is contestant number 11, Shruti K. Nair from Kerala. more powerful than a woman's voice for her dreams. Namaskaram Kuchin, I am Shruti, currently working as a software engineer in Bangalore. When I was young, the topic of my marriage was given more priority than my education my family. My dream's wings may have been cut off only because I was a girl who bore all the social pressure. 
but I had enough voice to refuse that. From a girl who doubted her self-existence to a woman who is standing here with so much confidence and positivity, this journey has taught me a lot. Most notably, the importance of financial independence among women and prioritization of mental health among the youth. I am a woman who dreams big, works hard, and stays resilient. And I want to represent myself in an international platform like Mrs. Glam World on behalf of bold, brave, and beautiful married women in our nation. Because my life has shown me, everything is within your power, and your power is within you. Thank you so much. Thank you, Shruti. Glad to have you here. Next is contestant number 12, Vaishali S. from Tamil Nadu. A warm afternoon to everyone here. I'm Vaishali from Chennai. I'm a proud single mom to an almost five-year-old daughter, Deera Sena, ex-professor of electrical engineering, HR professional, makeup artist, MC, model, and an influencer. After sowing the seeds of knowledge in my students for about 10 years, I am now bridging the gap between their education and career as an HR. Prior to this, I decided it's high time to do something for the society, and that's when I donated my hair completely for making wigs for cancer survivors, and ever since then, I've been an inspiration to many to do the same, and that is something I'm very proud of, and that paved the path for me to become an influencer. I would like to call myself an inspirer more than an influencer. Being a strong advocate of self-love, I believe self-love has the magic to transform a person into anything they believe in because I am what I am right now because of self-love. I am still metamorphizing inside my cocoon and I'm looking forward to spread my wings, fly high as an amazing butterfly in this big, beautiful world. I take this opportunity to thank everyone for providing me the platform to rediscover myself. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much, Vaishali. Now let's listen to Dr. Vaishnavi Reddy from Andhra Pradesh. Hello, everyone. Namaste. I'm Dr. Vaishnavi Reddy from Nello, Andhra Pradesh. I'm, I'm a surgeon by profession. Being a child of an army man, I grew up in a disciplined environment with patriotism and love for nation. As my zodiac defines, I am calm and confident girl. Apart from being surgeon by profession, I lean towards creative activities like singing, dancing, and painting. I always strive to learn new things and work for it. Pegasus pageantry really came as a surprise for me to participate and to prepare for it, as it really helped to improve my self-confidence and a sort of self-reflection for me. I'm a girl who dreams big, works hard, and stays resilient towards all the odds set against me. I want to encourage other young women and uplift those around me with my self-confidence. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now we've got introduced to all the contestants. It's time for us to start the judges' interaction segment. So please step forward as I call out your name. Choose a judge by picking the card and then answer the question asked to you by the judge. Requesting contestant number 8, Shalu Raj, to step forward. Richie Baskar, sir. Hi. Hello. Nalla Rikkingla. Nalla Rikke. Okay. Uh, what bothers you most about what is happening in your country today? Thank you so much for this question. The marital rape and the juvenile rape, this bothers me a lot. I always wanted the law to be very, very strict. I think these two should be avoided and I feel the law must increase the age for the juvenile. It shouldn't be 18. If a person can rape at the age of 16 or 17, why, why should be released? Feel the freshness. Feel the softness. DQ 78 TFM Great One Soap.